Hey guys, it's Kyrie Kid here, and I'm doing a C sharp tutorial. So I don't really know how to do C sharp, so this is kind of weird. But I'm, I'm doing it. The more I learn, so yeah, I'm gonna do what I learn in C sharp and show you guys how to do it. So that's awesome. This is something I already did. So I start a new project. By the way, I'm using Visual Studio from Microsoft, so. You can download that. I'm not really going to go into much detail on how to get it. Because I think a lot of things do that. Anyway, so you want to create a project. And you want to go on Visual C. And then go to console application. So yeah. First off, none of this stuff matters right off the bat. This is just like what the engine is using and stuff. You're going to worry about what's in main for right now. The other stuff... Well, you will get in for more complicated programming. So, here we go. Get the type in console. You can kind of click on these to make it faster. Because I'm a slow typer. Dot. Right. Line. And then you have to go. Right. Put that curvy thing there. I can't even think of the name. You have to put parentheses and then you need to put where they what get the one them right. So I'm gonna put write your name or else. <laughs> so yeah, that, that was kinda long. So you have to write that and then you have to I'm gonna put like a Dash mark, just to tell you what it is. I'm just gonna put does stuff because I'm too lazy to write out the description. Does stuff. But I always use that to separate my code. Oh, wait! How did I forget to add the semicolon at the end? You need to make sure you do that. See, I'm that new to programming that I didn't even, I didn't even do that. Anyway. So hold on. Alright, anyway, I just had to go check my other code, so yeah, I'm really new to this. Anyway, you're gonna write wanna write string and name. Exactly like you see here. The reason why you're gonna write string is that a string is what's gonna be read back like uh well I'm gonna show you later on what exactly a string does because it's kinda complicated to explain it right now. It's kind of reads the name back to you. Yeah. Because, like, I'm just gonna put reads the name back to you. you. You'll understand later. Anyway. Wait, do I need to put some echo on there? Hold on a second. I, I, I don't think so. Hold on. Anyway, yeah, I wasn't actually done. I'm like, I really forgot what to do. I don't even know how. Let's put string equals console read line so it reads the your name back to you. So yeah, now it makes sense. Dot read line. What? How did I get all the way up there? Dot read. There it is. And then you're going to want to put parentheses in, close it. I'm pretty sure. Anyway, I kind of did something stupid here. I forgot you're supposed to put two. Darn it. You're supposed to put two here. So, yeah, if you're following along with my stuff, good luck. I suck. So, yeah, that's all of that. And now you're going on to the next line. And this is where things get kind of complicated. So you're going to want to put console right line again. Console dot right line. And then you want to put like a comma thing. And then you want to put parentheses. Well, you don't want to put parentheses yet. You want to put name, which was we what was what we declared a string earlier. And that will read the name back to us, and then we're gonna add, put a plus, 
the name plus it's saying that name sucks because you know if you're in America your name probably sucks anyway because American names just aren't clever I'm just kidding I'm from America so I can even say that and you wanna close that print well yeah whatever that is I can't think of the name today and you're pretty much done with that line and you have to add one more thing in I'll explain why you have to add it in later but you're gonna add in console.write line Uh, see, I'm such a slow type. I'm such a slow typer. How can you, how can you watch this? <laughs> anyway, anyone will put those two things again. Anyone will put a semicolon at the end. And yeah, they're pretty much done. So let's run this, baby. Write your name or else. Okay, Kyron. Oh crap, I forgot to do something. Hold on. Anyway, I forgot something really, really stupid. Hey, hold on. Well, I forgot something really, really stupid. Well, what I forgot was... I, I, I'm missing a whole line here, so... What the heck was that? <laughs> My computer is really messed up. Anyway. You want to write console... Dot... Right line... There it is. And you wanna put do like the same thing we did earlier. And you're gonna put press enter for done with me. Or whatever you want. I don't really care because it's you. there and then a semicolon because I almost forgot again man I'm gonna be a terrible programmer so yeah and you wanted this to happen so you wanna change this to read line right here Might as well rewrite the whole thing because you know that console dot what no I did not want to put that right line that's not how you spell right what the heck. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a bad. Wait, I was supposed to put read line. What the heck? Yeah, to say this isn't my day. Anyway, I'm gonna put read line there. So what that does is so it writes this line and then you pr and it reads it and then you have to press enter for it the for it the end the program. So we're we're done. Hopefully. Darn it! No, I don't want to run the last successful build. Oh, I forgot something really stupid. I need to add this. I deleted it by accident. Anyway, what? Write your name. I, well, yeah, I spelled right wrong. What the heck's wrong with me? Anyway, Kyron. Kyron, that name sucks. Press enter if you're done with me. See? Well, that's pretty much it. Yeah, probably the worst program ever. It only took me 10 minutes to do. Yeah, so I'll try to make an episode next month because, let's be realistic, I'm not a weekly guy. I'm more monthly. Like a girl or something. Yeah, I'm not getting into that. Well, I'll see you guys next time. Stay Kyrie and Kiddish.